Yeah, so I didn't really document this very well. However, it was about, yeah, I worked today. So it was about two o'clock before I even started the idea. Um, turned on the inverter, turned on the deep freeze. I've got three Harbor Freight kits. Yeah, three of the 100 watt kits. These ones. And four Walmart large deep cycle batteries, 100 watt hours each, something like that. For, I just turned the inverter off now, like a few minutes ago. So basically in six hours, solar powered only to the batteries, I've got ice in my lemonade. And it was warm in here. So, heck yeah. That's outstanding. So by nine o'clock or so tomorrow, nine, maybe 10 o'clock, I'll leave the inverter off as much as I can until about 10 o'clock and then I'll run it again. Because now that it's cold, also I backed off the thermostat. I had it on maximum cold. I turned it to, I think seven out of five, or I mean five out of seven. But that should use less power. I don't need ice. I just want it to stay nice and cold, like a fridge. I don't need to make ice, but nice would be nice. Nice is, nice is ice, ice is nice. So I put the rest of the freezer packs in there, so hopefully that'll help stabilize the temperature. This is what I couldn't do last year, was make ice off of solar only and battery. And I haven't been running generator on that battery bank for weeks, really haven't had to because last week when I did laundry I had the generator over here so I didn't run a cord over I could have topped off the batteries but I really didn't need to so that freezer has been sitting for months haven't used it haven't really needed it kind of phased it out it was cold enough what I found is even without turning on the cooler like a little portable refrigerator cooler I could leave things in there and it was cold enough at night and then it would insulate it from the heat of the day so it would tend to stay cooler in the cooler than it was out here so maybe it would stabilize at 60 degrees or 50 degrees the fridge is 40 degrees so that actually worked out pretty good thing was I could never get ice before because I couldn't run the generator for more than a few hours before I'd either have to leave or I got tired of running it and I never had enough battery capacity to keep it going. So the best I could ever really hope for was that I could get stuff cold and you know, all I could really hope for is to get things cold enough, shut the generator off, hope it had enough cooling insulation to keep it cold but I very seldom had ice there I am first day solar and batteries only no generator I got ice that's freaking awesome I'm pretty excited about that you can tell